Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's Jeff at Lockdown Security, www.lockdownsecurity.ca. And today's brief video is all about the VFO HK3C and HK4 hardwire kits for VFO dash cameras. Now, a lot of you have asked us, what's the difference between an HK3C and an HK4? And I am here to tell you that the difference is the USB-C output. The HK3C has a USB-C output that is square, it's straight and the HK4 has a USB-C output that is on a angle. Whether you call it a right-hand angle or a left-hand angle, it basically plugs in either way because it's USB-C, but it is an angled connector. And they call for these cables for the different models. I just made a video on the T130, which calls for the HK4, but they are reversible. You could use either cable in either application. Just your cable maintenance might be a little bit different depending on which one you use. For all of you, all of you who are asking kind of what these do, they essentially take 12 volts in and drop it down to five volt USB out. The other thing they do is allow you to utilize parking mode. And if you take a look here, they have got a voltage cutoff. Essentially you can set it to 11.8, 12, 12.2, 12 12.4. If this senses an input voltage that is below the set threshold, it will shut power off to the camera. As you'll see the input wires, you have red, black, and yellow. Red is constant power, battery power. Black is chassis ground and yellow is ACC, otherwise known as accessory or ignition. Essentially, that's your switched input that tells this device when to start monitoring the battery voltage and when to switch the compatible camera into parking mode. Uh, these are universal cables. They are designed to work with VFO cameras specifically. However, if your camera has a USB-C, as in it's not a VFO model, you could utilize uh, these cables. Hopefully that helps to solve the question of what the difference is between the HK3C and the HK4. There are two other versions, older versions of these camera cables. There's the HK2 and the HK3. HK2 mini USB has power and ground input. That's it. Battery cutoff. That's it. No ignition excuse me, no ignition input. HK3, which is the prior generation to this, same thing, mini USB instead of USB-C with an angled uh, USB connector. But all things equal, same input, same little dongle, everything just different USB end. Hopefully that cleared up what the difference was. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you could subscribe to our YouTube channel, it goes a long way to help us make more videos like this in the future. Link to these products in the description below. We sell dash cameras on our website, lockdownsecurity.ca. We match all prices out there and we hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you.